हेलो दिस इज द सेशन फिफ्थ ऑफ फ्यूजन एक्सप्रेशन सीरीज एंड टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ टू रिमूव स्पील यूजिंग एक्सप्रेशन सो देर आर मल्टीपल वेज टू रिमूव स्पील्स बट आई चूज यूजिंग एक्सप्रेशन बिकॉज दिस इज एक्सप्रेशन सीरीज एंड फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ द लॉजिक बिहाइंड दिस स्पील रिमूविंग एक्सप्रेशन so for that i am going on a ppt slide show so i consider a small part of an image and here you see some green spill some skinny color brownish color and all these things so there is very uh, famous logic to remove spill first of all i show you the logic and then we implement that logic in fusion so this is the logic and this uh, particular logic is apply on only on green channel so red and blue remain same because here we consider a green screen uh, so we have to remove the green chroma from my image or my sequence so for green and this logic apply on green channel so if green is greater than average of red and blue that is red plus blue divided by 2 then replace those pixels with average of red and blue else remain green so where for example here it is obviously that green is higher than red and blue's average so here we replace this pixel especially in green channel is average of red and blue and where for example here where there is green is less than average of red and blue so we can remain green channel as it is okay so this is calculation is based on pixel to pixel so for example here i have green channel of this particular part of an image and this is the average of red and blue that is red plus blue divided by 2 and we compare pixel to pixel and we apply the same logic as i show you so here we got this kind of layout where this pixel that white part shows that here the green channel is greater than average of red and blue and here it is lesser than red and blue so here we remain green channel at is and here we replace that particular green information with red plus blue divided by 2 that is average of red and blue so that's how we get this image Okay so let's start or uh, let's apply this logic in fusion using expression so here i already create uh, one mat for this particular footage using some uh, king methods so i'm not focusing on that methods right now so here i'm using tools masculinous and custom tool can okay, i am going to channel okay now see here this logic that we apply that if green is greater than average of red and blue then we replace a green channel with average of red and blue else we remain green same so here this expression the default expression is not work on pixel to pixel so here we have to develop that particular logic so for that what am i going to do i just create one custom tool and here that is g1 represent green and this is input one so g1 r1 and b1 it's the channel of input 
red green and blue so here I just divide these things by R1 plus P1 divide by 2 okay and I just right now just copy the same thing over here and over here okay so I got this kind of output so when I get green greater than average of red and blue I got bright value and that is one and when green is lesser than red and blue average of red and blue I got some dark portion so now to segregate this two things so for that I create one brightness and contrast and here in low I set this value to 0.999 so now this white portion represent that there is green is heavier and there the green is not heavier than average of red and blue okay now I create one more custom tool and here in channel I just write R1 plus B1 divide by 2 so see here I remove this pill now here is my mat now I create one bitmap apply this thing dominance value I create one merge node I put this original content as my background this green spill removing as my foreground and this footage as my mat as my mask so now see this for example here I see the lips so here lips remain same just I change the green heavier green color with average of red and blue now I have to just apply this mat on this merge so I create one mat control I put this merge as my background or my input and this as my garbage mat and I just invert garbage mat over here so now you see we remove the spill very neatly using this expression now I enhance this expression things using some custom tools so here first of all I create one user control a channel and I set is to divider and here my minimum range is 1 and maximum is maybe 2 default is 2 3 ok and set ok ok so whenever you write something in this custom tool so this can call as a string ok so how to add expression basically this is the simple logic if you want to add some expression for example here I write expression 
and you see this is text because this is the string so here how you write these things so g1 divide by r1 plus r2 bracket divide by my string is over because I want to control on my divider so semicolon uh, that then dot dot then I just call this divider again dot dot then bracket over and again like this so this I just copy this thing I create one text tool and you see text inverted comma g1 divide by bracket bracket r1 plus b1 and here you want to uh, add some controllers value so user defined value so i just inverted comma over dot dot i call that divider inverted comma bracket inverted comma over this text bracket so here these things happen even i apply expression over here expression over here and I just call this read expression so it remains same even I call same expression things over here so here dot dot and I call this divider again dot dot inverted comma this bracket bracket and bracket over Mat control and this now if I select these things and I adjust the thing and this look like that so we can increase or decrease the spill amount using these controllers so that's how you create some cool stuff so you can create one macro for this you just have to select these things create one macro and add that divider things as a controller so hope you like this tutorial see you soon with ne next session